Today we are watching Aliens. I checked out Alien last week and I very much enjoyed it. It was such a wonderful watch and I'm a bit ashamed to say that this is one of the franchises that I haven't really watched much of. I feel like there's a bunch of movies that I haven't really watched that I should have by now. Like The Godfather. I haven't seen either of those. That's besides the point. We are here to watch Aliens. I know I have not seen this. And just by the name itself, I'm I'm going to guess, like, I assume they're adding more aliens, because how else would you up the stakes of a sequel, you know? Last time they struggled to get rid of one. This time, they're going to have to get rid of two or three or four. Maybe a whole colony or something. A whole town. Maybe we'll see a town of aliens. Let's, uh, let's jump in and see. I don't have much of a connection to the Aliens film. So I don't know what uh, what to expect. I don't know what is considered the good ones, which were considered the bad ones. I assume this one is good. I also saw it said James Cameron, a James Cameron film, at the beginning. Did he direct this one? You could have knocked a bit. For all you know, people could be there. Is this her people, maybe? Like, did they call out to her? Scanning for life forms, are you? you? You found a little frozen Sigourney. A woman! Bio readouts are all on the green. And a cat. Ah, oh, there goes our salvage, guys. I mean, technically, you can still sell the ship that she's in, couldn't you? How did they film that, honestly? How did they get that shot of all the space stations? Come here. How are you, you stupid cat? How are you? Where have you been? Very much how cat you a cat owner. How were how were where were you? How are you, you stupid cat? I always say, you can talk to animals pretty much however you want. You can call them any name you want. As long as you say with a good infliction, they don't know the difference between good and bad words. It's just that uh, this might be a shock. Has she been asleep? Please. 57 years. Damn. Am I supposed to think it's a chest burster? If it is, I'm going to assume it's a, a dream she's having right now. No, you're just having an anxiety attack. Oh yeah, it's a dream. The analysis team which went over the lifeboat centimeter by centimeter found no physical evidence of the creature you described. Good. That's because I blew it out of the goddamn airlock. Yeah. Like, so I told you I destroyed it and you're wondering where it is? A creature that gestates inside a living human host. Yes. These are your words. And has concentrated acid for blood. That's right. <laughs> she does, it does sound kind of nutty, but yes. Honestly, if you've been gone for 57 years, don't worry about them. You know what I mean? You're alive. Go back to living your life. Because if one of those things gets down here, then that will be old. And all of this, this bullshit that you think is so important, you can It took you 57 years to get here. Something like that, you know? To be found. I don't think, it, I think you're good for now, you know? I understand that they are smart. They build a spaceship, so they have some sort of intelligence, but they're not hunting you down right now. There have been people there for over 20 years and they never complained about any hostile organ. Are they gonna go and find them? Or are they going to be hunted down by them? How many are there? How many colonists? I don't know, 60, maybe 70 families. Ooh. Do you mind? You just made 60 or 70 aliens. Families of aliens. Yeah. Let's say four per family on average. Honestly, girl, don't worry about it. <coughs> just be happy you and Jonesy are alive. You got a wonderful cat. Live, breathe, and smoke your cigarette. Ripley, we have to talk. They've lost contact with the colony on LV-426. Yeah, no shit. When did you lose contact, and why are you just, like, bringing it up now? Yeah, but we don't know exactly what's going on out there. It may just be a down transmitter, okay? But if it's not, I would like you there as an advisor. And that's all. 
Look, I don't. I told you what I know about it. Read my notes. That's all I can say. I can tell you it's black. It has a tail. It's like eleven feet tall, maybe. It has a mouth within its mouth. Come on, that's a second chance, kiddo. And I think personal kiddo, I'm at least fifty-seven years older than you. What would you do, Jonesy? Yeah, me too. So now, how long have they been in suspension? Like, another year? Has it been only like a couple days? Gorman, Apon, Hicks, Pharaoh, Vertaz, Drake. That's all I could read. There was a jump cut there. A, cigar, a, a cigar ready to go. Have you ever been mistaken for a man? No. Have you? Oh, let's go. I've seen this. Ah, that face. Hell yeah. I feel like the second he puts his hand over yours, you got to trust him. You know, I'm sure he, I'm 99% sure he's an android. That was the way they were showing that. The second he puts his hand on yours, he's calibrating. He's, he can only do it between his hands. He's making sure he got it, you know? You never said anything about an android being on board. Why not? It never occurred to me. It's just common practice. We always have a synthetic on board. I prefer the term artificial person myself. I feel like artificial person would be more rude because that's like saying like quite literally like a subhuman you know what i mean you're not fully there but you're there kind of right now i'm gonna say bishop is not gonna be bad and the reason why i say that is because last movie the artificial human was um bad so this movie they're gonna make you think they're bad and it's not gonna be bad how do i get out of this chicken shit outfit you secure that shit hudson these characters are not as good as the last ones. Most of these people are arrogant and annoying. And not in a good way. I'm just waiting for them to die. Chekhov's robot. I've seen the ending to this movie. Or at least part of it. Because I remember this robot. Get your fucking hands off for you stupid bitch. Or something like that. That just unlocked a memory. I feel like kind of a fifth wheel around here. Is there anything I can do? I don't know. Is there anything you can do? I can do anything you can do and better, so I feel like this could go horribly wrong. This still doesn't seem like OSHA safe. How did they film this? That kind of looked like Batman's car. The Batmobile. Absolutely badasses. <laughs> Absolutely badasses. Let's go. Get those weapons stowed. Let's go. Come on, settle down, people. This is kind of a cool old tank vehicle thing. Ready to get it on. You're gonna die. That's what's gonna happen. Dive, 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 dive. We're in the pipe. Five by five. Oh, yeah. Right, right through a painting of clouds. Oh, there we go. You're popping all the wings now. Coming around for a 709er. Terminal guidance locked in. Where's the damn beacon? Oh, I see it. It's gonna be a town on fire. I feel like you should report back already. You've already been in here for like 15 seconds, 20 seconds. Hey guys, it looks really fucked up in here. You know how these guys, they don't really, uh, they don't really look like soldiers. They kind of look like actors. They're too goofy and eccentric characters, you know? Somebody must have bagged one of everybody's bad guys here. I fucking told you! Starts yelling at Burke. Nobody's home. Roger. Sir, uh, this place is dead. Whatever happened here, I think we missed it. All right, the area's secured. Let's go in and see what the computer can Wait tell us. It's not secure. The area's right? secured, Ripley. Oh, I'm staying in here anyways. You guys can go in if you think it's secure. I'll chill here. But it looks like uh, the barricade didn't hold. Any bodies? No, sir. Last stand. Must have been a hell of a fight. I don't think it was the last stand. I think they were trying to block something in. Oh, what's she seeing? Lieutenant. That's not good. So what, did they find them and they were studying them previously here? And the mom showed up and was angry. Wiped out the whole civilization. Careful, Burke. 
It looks a bit, uh... <laughs> looks like a vagina to me. A weird one, at least. It's moving. Which way? It's coming straight for Straight up. It's gonna be a baby. Wait, no, it's moving. It's gonna be a child though, right? I remember, that's what she says at the end. Let go of her, she's talking about the, about the child, right? Let go of her, you motherfucking bitch, you stupid ass alien. And then punches her out the airlock. Fuck. You need to become a better soldier. Because even this guy knew that was not a, an alien. That was you. You're terrible. Trigger discipline. Easy, easy. I got her. Ow! I got her. Instantly starts yanking her and bitten. Hey, where'd she go? Oh, she's outsmarting them through the vents. Why does this airway slash vent system have such a big opening? It's a giant hole here. Easy. Easy. It's gonna be okay. It's all right. You're gonna be okay. Tell her you're trying to save her. Maybe say something like that. Rebecca Jordan. Oh, I don't know how you managed to stay alive. But you're one brave kid, Rebecca. Agreed. New. What about your brother? What's his name? Timmy. Timmy? Maybe hiding like you were. No, I watched him get fucking gored. They're soldiers. It won't make any difference. So then why are you hiding? It won't make a difference and you expect to die anyways. Why are you hiding? Just saying. It's a nice pet you got there, Bishop. Magnificent, isn't it? Yo! It's actually quite amazing that the synthetics, the synthetic humans are more curious than the humans are into the alien. You know, I'm realizing we're about an hour in now. A bit less, I'd say. But there hasn't been an alien yet. Not even one. And this is called Aliens with an S. What is that? I don't know. Proceed inside. Ripley, were you not there when they got the eggs eat? on their face, like when they, when the face natural grabbed Kane. This kind of looks like the area they were in, slightly at least. The other one looked like a full spaceship that went down, and this one's like a call of what their houses would be like. Lieutenant, what do those pulse rifles fire? 10 millimeter explosive tip caseless. Standard light armor piercing round one. Look where your team is, they're right under the primary heat exchangers. So? So one shot goes boom. She's talking about a thermonuclear explosion and adios muchachos. Adios muchachos, you're blowing up to the skies. I want you to collect magazines from everybody. He fucking- Oh, that's smart. That's actually smart, just straight up be like, nope, you can't shoot. Thanks a lot, sir. Thanks, cover our ass. Head him out, people. I'd like to keep this handy. Oh, close encounters. Hey, are we gonna see a little nuclear explosion? They're gonna Godzilla minus one this building. Go to infrared, people. Look sharp. What's happening, Apon? Can't see anything in here. Pull your team out, Gorman. Yeah. Pull your team out, throw a grenade in there, run away. Leave them in a nuclear blast. Fuck this planet. How do these aliens reproduce without other aliens i'm sure it doesn't need to be a human that it reproduces with i know there's an aliens versus predators movie i'm sure they have an alien and predator in that movie oh there he is damn just burned your friend alive he probably died from the fall though so that's all right uh, I want you to lay down a suppressing fire with the That's good. Great. Great. Oh, Hold your fire, God damn it. The place is going to explode and then they're going to just leave these three, right? Just tell them to run. Whoever's left, get the Just shut up. God damn it. Where's the phone? Where's the phone? Sergeant's dog. Get the fuck out of here. Exactly. That's what, that's what the dude in the chair should have said. Just get the fuck out of there. Turn this thing around. 
had your chance, Gorman. Shout out Burke. He's at least, you know, believe in Ripley. Not believing in Ripley, trusting Ripley. That's the word. Ooh. Fucking tore him apart. Oh, there we go. Did they have some sort of relationship that we didn't really get to see? Oh, I thought that was a robot hand. I was like, hang on. Oh, shit. Now gun it. Yeah, the power of family. Don Toretto would never. Don Toretto? Dominic Toretto. The Sarge and Dietrich aren't dead, man. Their signs were real low, but they ain't dead. Then we go back in there and get the fuck, fuck that. Don't leave our people behind. I ain't side. going back in you there. You can't help like them. Me. They're using. They're now going to be used as a little baby. Yeah, they're going to be a little baby farm. Jesus, this ain't happening, man. This can't be happening, man. This isn't happening. It sound very much like Matthew Lillard there when you when you get stabbed and scream. This is an emotional moment for all of us, okay? I know that. But let's not make snap judgments, please. No, fuck this place. Fuck this planet. She's we're dealing with, and I don't think that you or I or anybody has the right to arbitrarily exterminate them. Wrong. Yeah. Wrong. I've met the, I've met them the most. I have the most experience with them. I have the right to say. Pharaoh, do you copy? Standing by. Prep for dust off. We're gonna need immediate evac. Roger. On our way. Hell yeah. I forgot about those people up there. They're just, what were they doing? Could they hear it happening? Smoking cigarettes in there. Move it, Spunkmeyer. We're rolling. Spunkmeyer? Spunkmeyer. Hold on a second. There's something. This is why they call him Spunkmeyer. He finds it everywhere. Spunkmeyer. God damn it. She's gonna get alienized. Where the fu Oh. Run! How do you get out? Like, how do you get out of the planet now? How do you get back to your ship? Now I want you to get on a terminal and call up some kind of floor plan file. Do you understand? Construction blueprints. I don't care. Anything that shows the layout of this place. Are you listening? Yeah. We don't have much time. Okay. Okay, I'm on it. Hudson, just relax. You fucking got this, Hudson. I'll be in med lab. Check on Gorman. Continue my analysis. Fine. So you you you're still connected to the air. Like you you haven't breached outside. I feel like you should separate yourself from anything alien, especially that medical area. Well, we gotta figure on them getting into the complex. That's right, so... Are you eating something or yawning, Newt? Is she secretly an alien? What's it for? It's a locator. Then I can find you anywhere in the complex on this. Thanks. Doesn't mean we're engaged or anything. I was gonna say, are they now building a relationship? So far, I think this has been a very well done sequel. Although I, they've leaned more into action, it seems, than they did with horror slash suspense or thriller in the other one. This one definitely just feels like it's been an action movie so far. The first hour has been at least, or an hour and a half. Take this for luck. Don't go, please. Newt, I'm going to be right in the next room. Actually, don't leave her. Yeah, don't leave her. She just fucking keels over and dies. No, she's gonna save this little girl. Did she ever talk about wanting kids in the last movie? But each one of these things comes from an egg, right? So who's laying these eggs? I'm not sure. It must be something we haven't seen yet. That's a, okay, so there's a queen, like a bee of sorts, that lays eggs. The eggs turn into face crawlers. But like, what happens if there's no humans? If there's nothing for the face crawlers to latch onto? Do they just grow into normal aliens? Do they stay that size? Do they just stay eggs? There's got to be lore to this. Bad call. Bad call. Right. These people are dead, Burke! Don't you have any idea what you've done here? 
Well, I'm going to make sure that they nail you right to the wall for this. You're not going to sleaze your way out of this one. Right to the wall. Kill him, honestly. Not even. She was right down the fucking leg, you know? Sit, sit him down. Bang, bang. Right down the kneecaps, you know? What about the colony transmitters? The uplink tower down at the other end. Why can't we use No, them? I checked. The, the hardwaring between here and there was damaged. I don't trust... I don't know if I should trust Bishop. I'm curious if Ripley has, if he can feel pain, but he can't, he cannot be face hugged, you know? He can't be, be embryoed. I don't know what the fucking word is. 30 minutes to prep the ship and about 50 minutes flight time. It's gonna be close. <laughs> that, was, that was actually good, what the, what the fuck just gives it back? I don't need, I don't want this. Oh shit! Really welding it shut and everything. You got this. I'm 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 gonna stand on my grounds of the first thing that I said about Bishop. I trust him. They're not gonna put two bad guys in a row unless like Burke's like a synthetic. To a personal friend of mine, this is an M41A pulse rifle, 10 millimeter, an over and under 30 millimeter pump action grenade launcher. Feel the weight. Feel it. He's, he loves his gun. I just want to say that I have a Patreon where I post all my reactions in their full length. So if you want to show your support, then please head down to the description or the pinned comment below. Thank you. He's really just shimmying down there. You can't really crawl. You're you're doing good, Bishop. Uh, that's a grenade launcher. I don't think you want to mess with that. You started this. Show me everything. I can handle myself. That don't really look like much of a grenade. It looks like a... I don't know what a grenade launcher really looks like, but that does not look like really a size for a, even a small grenade. Is she gonna f fucking shoot the alien babies? Or face crawlers, whatever you want to fucking call them. Oh, when you turned the, all the lights off in this room previously, it was pitch black. It's not like you turned any lights on you just you just entered the room again and now it's way brighter in here i've been telling you fucking shoot him i thought you brought the gun with you down there i thought you put it in front of newt Honestly, knowing th what this is, you could just beat the fuck out of it. Grab it, grab it by its tail and swing that shit around, you know? No, you brought the gun in there. I'm not crazy. I am not crazy. I know you brought the gun in there. Back in, Bishop. You've got it into auto refuel mode and it's sequencing, right? It's right. Okay, good. Burke. Back to me when you've activated the fucking Burke. Is he a synthetic? Or is he just a corporate asshole? That's smart. The doors have to open up now. Meet me in med lab. We've got a fire. This is a terrible lab. The door should automatically open, shouldn't they? Also, is the reason why the gun's not in there is because Burke, like, took the gun out and shut the doors on them? Okay, the strength of a kid. Burke! <laughs> it was Burke! I wasn't crazy. Hey, we grease this rat fuck son of a bitch, right? I agree. He figured that he could get an alien back to quarantine if one of us was impregnated. And then frozen for the trip home. Nobody would know about the embryos we were carrying. Me and Newt. Ew, he made it kind of creepy by having, the, like, two of the girls be the one that gets impregnated. I don't know which species is worse. You don't see them fucking each other over for a goddamn percentage. Damn. Right, we waste him. No offense. No! Actually, we don't know that. They really, they could be. For all you know, you could be on the exact opposite end of what the... Like, they could be going through the exact same situation you are. 
there could be a set of aliens that landed on this planet that needed to meet a quota of amount of eggs they brought and someone killed their queen and they are now impregnating this whole nation so that like this whole not nation what this whole civilization of people that landed here the 152 people or whatever from their point of view you could be the bad guys they're just trying to meet a quota too for all we know signal's weird must be some interference or something there's movement all over the place get back to operations it's game time it's game time baby let's go where have why have we not seen from bishop yet five meters man four what the hell oh my god they're above us oh my god oh, give me the light oh don't look up there like the way you are at least all right, like you're just gonna eh, boom die. That's what's gonna happen. Yeah. Ooh. Ew, seeing like six, seven of them crawling on a ceiling is fucking creepy. Burke's a terrible human. I hope that he just turns around. I'm, I'm hoping there's an alien in the room with him. You know. He's killing it. Quite literally, he's doing good. He's gonna run on the ammo and get fucked. Oh, no, or that. That works too. Let's go! 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 Move, Roman! Feel it! Now, if, even if you don't seal it, do they know how to use doors? Do they know what doors are? Yeah, open up that and have an alien on the other side. That's what I want to see. Get a skull caved in. Let's go. We didn't get to see it though. Which way is it to the landing field from here? How do you know? Oh, I guess this is her domain, right? These vents. Great. Oh, whoever's not following you doesn't know where to go. Wait, ETA, 16 minutes. Next. Holy shit, still gotta wait that long? Oh my god. I would feel like I'm dead right there when they're like, we still gotta wait 16 minutes. I'm like, I don't even know if we have 16 minutes left of ammo. I like how Newt can almost actually like straight up just run in it and all the all the adults are crouched in it. Damn. You don't deserve death, Velazquez. Oh, Velazquez. Oh, no. Velazquez is down. Velazquez! Oh, Vazquez. I thought it was Velazquez. Sorry, my bad. Let's go. You know, it's, it's not the best way to go out, but it's a noble thing to do. She just gets sucked into the vent. Don't let go. Have you never been on a jung jungle gym or anything? Fucking climb. Let go of your fucking doll. Oh my god. No! No! Come on, we can find her with this! So he knows that the watch is on her. We're coming! You still got 16 minutes though, you know? I guess now it'd be like 13 or 14, but you got the time. Can you hear me? That's a good little shot. Can they swim? We're almost there. Hang in there. Okay? Can the aliens swim? Honestly, you don't only have to get off like a third of those, and then you could bend the rest. Right? Just get one side and then pull the rest. No, those are thick bars. Never mind. You couldn't fucking bend those. No, just stay. Exactly. Okay, so at least they they did three fourths, like I said. Go! No! 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 They don't kill you. They, they don't kill you. They, she's alive. There we go. Then why have they been killing others? We've got to go now. Is this Hicks? Is this Hicks or Hudson? She's gonna hear like a distant. Ripley! Ripley, I'm still alive! Shut up, Bishop. 
I had a moment of doubt, a quick moment of doubt, but I believed in you. Not all synthetics can be bad, you know? Damn, you didn't even fly down the center. It wasn't symmetrical. It wasn't satisfying. She's loading the fuck up. Is she... Strapping them together? Four guns? <gasps> Let's fucking go, Ripley. Is that what she's doing? Or did she just strap a flashlight to it? Either way, let's hope she go for she four guns it. Oh, she's got a flamethrower and a gun. I thought those were cigars for a second. Six of them. Let's fucking go. Again, how they upped the ante? Like you know, before it was one alien, now it's multiple aliens. How do you raise the stakes of save the cat? Save the child. Let's fucking go, Ripley. You're a boss ass bitch and here's why. I saved a cat and I saved a fucking little girl from a invasive species of aliens. You know, they just made that Predator movie where they go like to the, um, the Native Americans in like the uh, early thousands, like fucking 1800s, 1600s, even earlier. Um, I want to see an alien movie like that, where they crash land on, like, Earth in the 1500s or some shit. No way, is she dead? Oh, okay. Don't scream. Oh, I take that back. Please scream, scream more. Let's go. Ew. What did they encase them in? Gonna come face to face with an alien? Oh no, shit. Got a bunch of eggs. How do the eggs know you're there and open up, you know? They should all just start opening up. Flame them the fuck out, though. Grit your teeth. Fucking flame them out. Oh, we're gonna see something new. Is it just an alien with like a pupus looking butt? Oh no, this is... This alien's got... Where's its legs? Is that its legs? Is it a giant four-legged fucking... Where's its joints? I wanna see it walk. It looks like it's got four legs and then two arms. And it's giant. And it's gone eight. The aliens have a little alien inside their mouth that looks like the mouth, the, the, the uh, face eaters. This one has an alien coming out of its mouth, like a full on sized alien looking thing coming out of its mouth. Holy shit. I'll kill your babies if you touch me. Yeah, show your threat. Yeah, you heard me, bitch. Not a, not didn't say a thing. I know a mother's. I I have that mother instinct in me, you know. I'll fucking burn your child if you touch me. Gas him. Too late. You lost your chance. She's like, really, really. I didn't I didn't have to do this, but. You're fucked. Let's go. Badass bitch mommy Sigourna Weaver. Let's go. Like 12 bullets left. Yeah, I said 16 when I said that. There we go. Bang. Fuck this bitch. Bang. Fuck this bitch. Bang. Fuck this bitch. Show it. Shoot another. Let's go. Bang. There we go. Ew, there was actually like yolk coming out. Not until I'm done with this bitch. You still have flamethrower gas? I thought they said it was half. Run, bitch, run! Oh, did she, is that not, was that not all her limbs I saw? Tear yourself from your sack, baby. Ooh. How much time is that? 30 seconds? Or is it exploding now? You now have four minutes. 
four minutes. Come on, God damn it! Take the stairs, baby. Elevators don't work during the fire exits or during fire alarms, you know? She's a big one. Fuck you, bitch. Yeah. Did she click both elevator buttons? Did they abandon her? Bishop! God damn you! I don't fully blame Bishop, honestly. It's not like he was alternatively trying to abandon her. He's got to be safe too. Bishop! Love your head on a fucking stake next time I see you. This is bullshit. You're supposed to wait for me. Close your eyes, baby! Oh, hell yeah, let's go! I'm sorry, Bishop. Damn, the music right now. Do a terrible rendition of it, but it's great. Let's go! Let's fucking go! Ooh, a nice little nuclear explosion effect in the background. Good job, Bishop. I only doubted you twice. I'm sorry if I scared you. That platform was just becoming too unstable. I had to circle and hope that things didn't get too rough to take you off. Bishop. You did much better than Ash, I'll tell you that. Oh no. No! <laughs> I finally trusted a synthetic and he got fucking destroyed. Why don't they give him extra powers? Why can't he like shoot a beam of lightning out of his eyes or something? No. He got fucking bifurcated. I think bifurcated's this way. I don't know what the word is. He got cut in half. That's what fucking happened. Not even, he got torn in half. That's worse. <laughs> Keep bashing your head against it, girl. Don't worry, some some of your blood will come out eventually. You'll make a hole. How how do how do synthetics die, honestly? Is he still alive? I can tell he's still alive right now, but will he die? Can he be rebuilt? Ah! Oh, I thought she was gonna scream. She didn't. Just keep crawling. Yeah, you got you're doing good. You're doing good. There we, there's the scream I was looking for. And here comes the badass bitch in an exosuit. Let's go. You get away from her, you stupid bitch, or something like that. Get away from her, you bitch. Should have said ugly bitch. I thought she said ugly bitch. She is an ugly bitch. She's an ugly bitch who's no queen. You're the fucking queen. Let's fucking go. <laughs> I will say the lack of music is a bit jarring. I feel like there should be a bit more amped music right now. She is fucking her up. Do what she did to Bishop. Yeah, fucking wring her neck out. I, again, I wonder how they filmed this. Is Sigourney Weaver even doing anything? Or is she just in a giant puppet that's been controlled by others? Oh, you're going with her. That's all right. At least you got rid of the queen. <sighs> New gets in a slightly smaller one and fucks around too. That'd be great. <laughs> oh no. No, not Bishop, grab on. Yeah, okay, good. I'm sorry, Ripley. Either your leg or arm would tear off. Or your shoe. That works too. Yeah, fuck this bitch. 
ending so nice they did it twice okay you can close the airlock now just saying bishop, bishop! let's go bishop's now king a really white oily creamed look an alfredo sauce looking type of king he's the alfredo king Mommy. oh god <laughs> Ripley's like, I'm not your fucking mom. All right. Human. And you were not bad for a synthetic. Sorry. Artificial human. I'll give you the respect. So they're saving Bishop. Bishop is being put under. And the girls are left standing. Let's go. A little tail sweeps across the screen. That was aliens i very much like that very different i feel than the second one but also very similar uh, i think they did a great job at expanding the universe going from one alien to multiple showing more uh, like a more side of the alien they got a queen should have been to their home in a way i think the only thing that i can really say i didn't like about this one is the ending figure out somewhere else to get rid of them don't shoot them on an airlock that feels I even like i know i joke saying oh ending so nice they did it twice but like fuck off honestly why do it twice it feels like a cop out it feels like he couldn't come up with anything better right maybe i don't know how should have left it at them blowing up the sh blowing up the big ship or whatever i very much enjoyed that i had fun with it i thought it was a good watch i'm excited to watch aliens 3 which i think is alien squared it's got a little three so but yeah i enjoyed this it wasn't scary or anything i found it definitely closer to an action movie there was obviously a few jump scares but definitely closer to action to me than it was to a thriller or a horror movie like the first let me know down below any comments you have any questions i may have asked or any recommendations any anything at all honestly talk to my cat anything you know just leave a comment say something literally say the word something i don't know leave a like for sure though as long as you enjoyed the video and also yeah if you want to see this and any of my other reactions in their full length then head over to the description of the pinned comment below where you can find a link to my patreon and there i post all my reactions everyone i've done i've barely i've only uploaded like maybe a third of the reactions i've done on youtube so go and check it out it's worth at least seeing what i got on there and for at four dollars you can get all my reactions one dollar to get all my early highlights to my reactions and everything above you'll see so yeah check it out with that being said i have been a guy named chase i enjoy movies and tv shows pretty much everything filmed related and i suck at outros so goodbye